How awful for you. Talk us through the day. You, you, you set out on the day, Danielle, thinking, I'm going to be on a bike. Yeah, and that's pretty exciting, pretty went out scary. I on, my, on um, Michael's motorbike for the first time mm. and I thought that was going to be the craziest thing will happen yeah. to me in that day and I thought you know so was that taken was, before yeah yeah just before we took off um, oh. I was actually terrified but obviously things turned worse and there was something else that I should have been more so you stopped of. off at a friend's house to, yeah. to, to pick something up yeah then what happened um, basically Michael had gone into the property and I was standing at the gate and um, waiting for him to come out the dog somehow had broken off the chain and I just heard Michael scream that oh. the dog had broke off and to get out of the gate. I got out of the gate but I was and I, I had to hold the gate shut to make sure the dog couldn't get back out but I had to watch helplessly at Michael being attacked and oh, no. knowing that there was nothing that I could oh. physically do. So he was on the ground, the dog's on top of him, yeah, biting um, him. Well, it got him on the on the backside. Oh, so. oh my gosh. You're so good, though, because <clears throat> the right thing to do is probably to just run and shut the gate and get out of the situation. No. I would have probably ran in there and made it ten times worse. Like, for you to have had to yeah, have held yeah. back. It was, so, <clears throat> it was so horrible, and all I could think was, like... I'm one. I'm so glad that the kids yeah. weren't oh there because yeah. the, there was no way that they would have survived because mm. the dog was so strong. Yeah. And to just watch. What help kind us. of a dog was it? Um, it I, I'm not up with my dogs because I yeah. haven't got one myself. But I think it was like a pit bull type cross dog. Type. Yeah. yeah. It, well, it was it's vicious. Like a dangerous I know that. Dog. And, and how did how did he eventually get away from the dog? He basically just had to fight fight with the dog. And so he just... wrestled the dog. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. yeah. And I was just so thankful that he'd actually, like, got me to, to safety yeah. as well because, yeah. no, it could have been so much worse. So you, you managed to... Obviously, he gets away from the dog, gets on the other side of the gate. Well, what did you do? Did you wait for an ambulance? Or? What happened was we... He had to wrestle the dog and he, he got the dog and he was able to get to the door, to the gate, mm -hmm. where I... It quickly let him yeah, out. So and we then got shut it again. Yeah, so shut it again. And then the dog's obviously really angry. It's got blood coming out <gasps> of its mouth. Oh, no. um, it was just, its eyes were bulging out of its head. I, honestly, like, I've never been so terrified in all my life. And I just could imagine this dog somehow, some way, getting back out. And yeah. I, mm. I just said to Michael, like, it's not only us that we need to be worried about, it's other people around. Like, yeah. we need to get this dog. Put down, like, yeah. put down or, you know, get it somewhere safe that it can't harm anybody else. So, so were you not... See, at that point, I would I would just be thinking, get away. I wouldn't even be thinking about the dog. Did, I, did you go straight to hospital? Yeah, well, after somebody... We had to phone somebody to come and get the dog yeah. first. It was a then, friend's dog, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. yeah. And you'd seen the dog before, <clears> and you'd been yeah. in this house yeah, before, we'd, and it'd been we'd fine. we'd seen the dog before, and... Did, every, did they fine. know that you, you were going to go to the house? Or? Yeah, yeah, they oh. knew that we were going to the house. Okay. So the dog was on a chain. I bet it got a dog or... Is, yeah, it, like is that what they have, of, have the dog for? Yeah, yeah, like yeah. looking after. So it, the dog must have fought someone. It was the trespass. Yeah, it was, was, it, was, it was just, honestly, like, terrifying. it was just the most frightening thing that had ever happened. So, and obviously, Michael ended up in hospital because, because of his injuries. Ooh. That, that's oh just God. some of some of the injuries there that we, that we can show. How is he now? He's doing OK. He's... Um, his back's really, really sore from oh. where he's had to obviously fight with the, the dog, dog and stuff. Yeah. And he's got like he's got to go for physio and mm. stuff like that. But he's doing okay. And what have the what have the doctors said? Of you know, he was he's he's, he's just really lucky to be mm. alive because if it would have got a main artery or he you could know, have bled, he would yeah. have. And that, he, that's what the doctors have said. If, it, if yeah. it had hit an artery, he could have died. Yeah. And then it's the mental damage, I suppose, afterwards. That's, how I, do you? I haven't slept well since. You've been having nightmares. Like, yeah, and Michael, like, it. he physically said that he saw his life, like, flash before oh. his eyes. And since then, we've just been like, right, we're going to live life to the full because you Gosh. just never know what's no. going to happen. Has it made you fall more in love with him? Because he was your hero that day, yeah. wasn't he? <laughs> yeah. He took the brunt. So, yeah, he, you know, I think it has brought us really close and mm. just realised that... You've just got to be so careful. Like, mm. you know, we knew the dog, but you just never, ever know. Is, is it true as well that um, he'd just seen a programme quite recently on somebody being attacked, so he kind of knew what to do in that situation? Yeah, basically, he'd read a story the week before about a man being attacked and killed by a dog. <laughs> oh, gosh. So he said to me that all he could think about when he was being attacked was 
basically that story and thinking to himself, I'm going to die. Oh, and that's oh all God. he could think mm. about. And then, but then something must have switched in his mind. And at the end of the story, it, it had said how to handle the dog or try and stop the dog from attacking yeah, you. Yeah, from attacking yeah. you. If you've enjoyed that, then why not click here for more? And don't forget to subscribe by clicking here so that you never miss out on the best Loose Women moments.